In this video we're going to be making use of the Stessa registration punch and our registration pins to align our paper in a slightly different way than punching the paper itself. Here we're starting with our registration pins and strips of thin plastic. This happens to be an orange mylar that I have but this could be clear mylar or some other very thin but resilient material like plastic and some painters tape. So let's get started. I've cut a whole bunch of these strips. They're about two inches wide and ten inches long and I punch them one at a time on the Stesser punch. Use of the Stesser punch is discussed and demoed in a different video. And I will begin by placing my blue tape on my hanger on the back of my first sheet of good paper. Just like that. There's the front. This is an exceedingly straightforward and simple process. I'm going to place my circular pin into the center hole and then an oblong pin on the right and on the left. I'll then tape the pins to my work surface. Now you can see that when I lift up my paper with the tab attached to it, I can place it back in exactly the same position each time. I should digress here slightly by saying that the reason why you might want to do this is because you may not want to punch your paper or you may have weird shaped paper or some other special reason for not being able to or not wanting to punch your paper. This is a little bit more work than punching individual sheets but it's very very handy. In this case we're going to use it for doing some linoleum block printing, but again you could use this for screen printing or litho or really whatever your imagination can come up with. So lining up my second sheet of good paper by eye on top of the first sheet, I then place my orange hanger tab and tape it on. Again there's the front and there's the back. And we will repeat. So this also works really well if your individual sheets aren't perfectly square or not exactly the same size. What's so lovely about the registration pin system is that wherever the hanger tab gets placed on that sheet of paper, it will be perfectly aligned every time. So aside from attaching a hanger to every one of your sheets of printing paper, here's one bonus tip. Cut a piece of clear mylar the same size as your printing sheets. It doesn't have to be the best piece of mylar you have, but clear mylar nonetheless. And then attach a hanger tab to it with tape in the exact same way you have with your paper. When you're at the press, take an impression on this piece of perfectly registered mylar. It'll be very handy to have this for planning subsequent layers or troubleshooting alignment issues you have later on in the project. And there you have it, a big stack of tabbed paper ready to print. 